YouTube, so what's good? It's your boy Cooley, you know, Mickey, Mickey, back, man. And, uh, you know, coming to y'all with another vlog, another video. We ain't at work today, but, uh, you know, still gotta grind, still gotta push these videos out, you know what I'm saying? And, uh, today I can just gotta, like, I'm just like, man, what's going on? It's like, uh, Every time I want to wash my car, it's either it's either raining or I didn't have a 50, 60 hour work week at work and I just be exhausted. I'm like, man, can I get a break? And today, they talk about it's gonna rain. And not only that it's gonna rain, but it's supposed to be raining for the next uh it's supposed to be raining for the next like three days, you know what I'm saying? Oh, before we get too far along into the video, please, 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 make sure you're liking, make sure you're sharing, and most of all, make sure you're subscribing. I'm getting the views. All you got to do is hit the subscribe button. All you got to do is hit the like button. You feel me? All you got to do is turn on post notifications on. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? You know, become a part of the community become a part of the organization you know what i'm saying watch a guy succeed and reach the top of the top of the top top you know what i'm saying you feel me but yeah man uh and it's like and it's not that i don't like the rain it's just i be trying to figure out why every time i gotta wash my car and it's about the rain or like i said i'm just super tired you feel me my job is uh my job is super easy, but at the same time, it's just, it's hard on the body. Not, not in a bad way, like I could do it. I'm not saying like the job is not impossible to do or something like that, but you know, you just you be repping and running. You know, we start our day anywhere in between like one o'clock to like three o'clock in the morning. And you know, you kind of get that freedom with my company. So, you know, that's cool, you feel know I me? Mean? But, having to be out there 10, 11, 12 hours sometimes, you know what I'm saying? It's getting rough. Having kids, having a family, you know what I'm saying? It's just, I don't know. And today was just one of them days where I just kind of woke up feeling, you know, a little, a little uh, relieved, you know, a little, a little bit of energized, you know, more than normal, and boom, you go to rain. Yeah, me. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to say. But uh, anyway, I'm in the car driving. Just came from uh, just came from uh, paying my light bill, and then I uh, had to do like the. I guess when you live in the apartments, they do like the trash and the sewer and one other thing. So you know, just getting up, getting out. Um, you know, taking care of business. It's real early right now. It's only like 9.45 in the morning. And to be honest with you, if I want to just kick back and chill, uh, I pretty much did everything I was going to do for the day. Well, you know, everything I plan to do. And I just plan to wake up and pay my bills. You know what I'm saying? You know, that's one of the reasons why you work hard. So you can, uh, so you can pay these bills. You know what I'm saying? Pay these bills, keep that food in the, keep that food in the house. You know, keep your girl and your kids happy, you feel me? And to be honest with you, that's the reason why I really make these videos. And so I could, uh, you know, keep the fam happy, you know, keep me happy, you know. Keep us level, you know, keep us out of the trying to survive, you know. I want to be living. I don't want to be surviving my whole life. You feel me? Yeah, that's why I work hard with my kids and my girl. You know, so it's gonna be good. I can't wait for this YouTube to start cracking for me, so uh, you know we can really be taking some vacations, travel the world. You never know. I might just wake up one day and just wanna just hey, give me the next flight, smuggle. You know what I'm saying? I'm out of here. <laughs> but that reminds me, man, I'm, I'm ready for a vacation. I'm, I'm 
I'm so ready for a vacation. Um, Cause I didn't, I didn't switch jobs a lot. Like I, I consistently work, but like I want to say the past couple years, I done probably had like probably had like uh what, like two two or three different jobs and like you know they ain't stay nowhere long enough yet to get a vacation i got a vacation coming up with this job um i think it's in april i'm not too sure when it is but i know i got another one at the end of august this company um i guess the first like first one like your first year all the way to like the third or fourth year you get two weeks and I think like your fifth year you get like uh, I believe you get like three weeks so I'm looking forward to that uh, on this one this is my first time getting vacation with them so I split it up one of them is coming up real soon like in a month or so and then like I said the other one will be like at the end of August or something like that I want to take the family somewhere do something different for sure for sure Definitely talk to my oldest daughter and my girl about it. So figure out some Sea World, Disney World, Disneyland. You know, just another city. Man, I guess that's the um, that's the like the, the bad thing though. Like, well, I don't really know if, if it's a bad thing or not. Y'all can comment down below and tell me. But uh, you know, I'm from Vegas. Feel me? Uh, I've been, I've been in Vegas my whole life. You know what I'm saying? And uh, um, I just be wanting to get out of the city. You feel me? Because I feel like I've been here so long. Like a lot of people that I meet, they be like, "Oh wow, you're from Vegas." I never met a person from Vegas. I'm like, hey, it's me. You know, I know a whole bunch more of them. You feel me? But, uh, yeah, man, I definitely want to get out the city and, uh, take a, I want to take a real vacation, you know what I'm saying? I don't want to just sit in the house and be running errands and doing a whole bunch of stuff that I got to do, like, just in a normal week. Like, I really want to take a vacation somewhere, be there for, like, maybe, like, four or five days. Because, I, you know, I do know, too, also, when I used to travel... Uh, when I used to travel a little bit a couple years ago, that like I, I feel like I only needed like two, three days somewhere, and then I'd be like, all right, I'm I'm ready to go back to the crib. You know what I'm saying? Ready to go back home. Uh, my two favorite places I visited so far had to be like uh, I'll say they had to be like Denver and Miami. I've been to Denver maybe like three, four times. I've only been to Miami once, but uh, and all this was way before COVID. So a couple years ago, man, some years back now, man. <laughs> it's time for your boy to get out the house, get out the city. Yeah, but yeah. Uh, those are two. Oh my love. Uh, yeah, I've been to. Um, my bad, I'm all over the place. I'm just trying to talk to y'all. You know, I'm just trying to give y'all content, give y'all videos, you know, give y'all something. You know, I'm just trying to I'm just trying to build my audience, you know what I'm saying? But I can't forget, my most favorite place of them all had to probably be uh, the Bay Area. When I say the Bay Area, I don't know, it's just, it's just different. Like, like, I don't know. I ain't, I ain't been out there in a few years either. I ain't really ain't been nowhere. I just been been on my grind, been on my hustle. You know what I'm saying? Whew! Just been busy, been tired. <laughs> but yeah, man. Um, Bay Area, I'll probably say is like the best out of all of them. But really, I don't know because whenever I go to Denver, I have a good time, especially downtown Denver. It's real nice out there. Miami was nice. Stay when I stayed out there, I was like maybe like two or three streets away from the beach. You just walk to uh, just walk to the beach every day. Get that water. It used to be nice. Man, I used to be out here living the life. You feel me? 
Nah, I just gotta work, 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 work. Get the bills paid. But I like paying my bills though, you know. To keep me grounded, to keep me level, you know, because you get a lot of money and it'd be like, ah, right, let me go. Let me go and do something, to, you know, that ain't really good. Something so important. You'd be like, nah, I'm good. Just take care of my stuff, you feel me? I like taking care of my stuff and not like depending on nobody. Like that's that's one thing. I don't I'm already like depending on nobody. Anybody knows shit. If I if I gotta ask you or something, I'm definitely gonna get back to you. But other than that, that's that's another reason why I work hard. It's depending on somebody else shit, they ain't gonna get it from me. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Definitely ain't gonna be dependent on nobody else, check. My own and mine's only lonely. But yeah, man, uh, back to this rain. It just starts sprinkling a little bit. Well, I'm pretty sure it's not probably gonna be out to just throughout the day. Just at different times of the day. It might be got the clouds over here. And then, yeah, it's all sunny over here. But I think everything is moving. Like, like towards this way because when I look back behind me it's all dark and gloomy and like in front of me and to my right it's like sunny so the storm is coming y'all get ready but how y'all enjoying the spring break with these kiddos at home I'm enjoying it my girl has some family come over uh, just been chilling been playing Mortal Kombat you know family stuff, you feel me, I'm trying to, and, and another thing, I'm trying to, like, open up to y'all, because, like, I really be nervous about, like, putting certain stuff on camera, but I know in order for me to succeed, and in order for me to win at this, at this, uh, at this social media thing, you know, I gotta open up a little more, so, y'all might get some random videos in between my, uh, my work videos, but, um, like I said, just comment down below and uh, let me know, you know, hey, we like vlogs like this or we like vlogs like that. Like, you know, feel free, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm here to entertain y'all, you know what I'm saying? So whatever I got to do to, um, to gain some traction, to get the wheels spinning, you know what I'm saying? That's what I want to do, you know, as long as it ain't. As long as it ain't nothing against my morals, you know, and how I view things in life, you feel me? But uh, other than that, I'm trying to get to the bag, man, by any means necessary. I'm trying to get to it. <sighs> Almost home. One thing I do like about spring break is you ain't got to worry about when you're driving. You ain't got to worry about all these school zones and all that. In Vegas, there's construction everywhere, so you always got to worry about that. And I, and it used to make me mad, but until I start going like other places, and the roads be messed up, or like, uh, or like um, the roads be messed up, or the buildings be old. But honestly, everything, everything in Vegas is like I don't want to say it's fairly new because it's it's a lot of the city that's old. But it's like they keep up the concrete, they keep they, they keep up the streets, you know. Um, like they just they just keep stuff up, you know. You ride around and the landscaping look nice, plants and stuff. You feel me? And at this point, I'm kind of just talking to y'all, just trying to stretch the video. You know what I'm saying? So uh, if you made it this far in the video and you're still watching, like I said, please make sure you like it. Make sure you subscribe and make sure you share. Make sure you at that church, at your workplace, in the line, at the grocery store, you know, at the airport. Just tell somebody about your boy. Like, hey man, this is YouTube Robbie watching. Be cool. You know what I'm saying? And you know everything I post is for motivation. You know, it ain't it ain't gonna be no money and it ain't gonna be nothing crazy, you know what I'm saying? But it's just it's just motivation to say, like, hey, you can do this, too. You feel like you're down on your luck? Pick up that camera. Start posting videos. You feel me? You never know what can happen.
YouTube, YouTube ain't the end. I feel like it's the beginning, you know? It's like so many people, so many people over the years got popping and got famous, you know, and now they doing way bigger things, all just because of a platform like YouTube or, you know, all these platforms out here, you know, it's, I feel like, I feel like now we got more social media, um, I feel like now we got more social media celebrities than we got, got actually, like, real celebrities, and, you know, um, don't, don't get it wrong, I'm not discrediting anybody, because at the same time, you still gotta put that work in, regardless if you, regardless if you a, a 20 year vet, you're doing whatever you do, or if you're just starting out, or you're trying to get your toes wet, kind of like me, you know what I'm saying, just pick something to keep doing it, you feel me, then once you get that under control, pick something else, and start doing that, you feel me, and uh, that's how you start earning all these different uh, streams of income, and that's what's really important, you know, it ain't, it ain't about, like, one particular thing, you know, and that's, that's life, that's why people get rich off so many different things, you know, people become wealthy off so many different things, just because, um, ain't nobody playing follow the leader, you know, if you want to sell houses, sell houses, you want to sell cars, sell cars, if you want to sell games, sell games, you know, if you want to sell, uh, I don't know, you know what I'm saying, but it's like, anything is possible, you want to open up a business, open up a business, you know what I'm saying, and just get it cracking, <laughs> it'd be a lot of people procrastinating, and you know, some people will go through with the business, and then, and then, uh, you know, they get it all set up, and it's all nice, and, you know, they forgot to um, do marketing. They forgot to do some clientele. So, you know, clientele ain't coming in how it's supposed to. And then you kind of get down about it. But you got to think about it. You, yeah, you did everything you're supposed to do. But yet, people still don't know you. You know? You got to put that... You got to put that money into some marketing or something. You know? You got to market yourself. That's the only way I feel to get ahead in this world. You gotta, you gotta campaign. You feel me? You gotta have a campaign. It's kind of, it's kind of like the presidential election. You feel what I'm saying? They hit all 50 states. They got all these different campaigns going. All these different commercials. You know, they just trying to make themselves seem like you know whatever, whatever. I don't really follow politics like that. You know, uh, I ain't gonna really speak on it. I can't speak on it because I don't really follow it. You know, I don't like them, so I don't follow them. I'm not saying I don't like them, like I got to follow with them, but it's just, I don't understand why we got to keep switching presidents and why we can't, why we can't just come to an agree, you know, agreement on what needs to happen. But, you know, I just, I don't know, but whatever with all that, you feel me? But like I said, man, it's all about. It's all about uh, putting them 10 toes on the pavement and getting to it. You know what I'm saying? And if that means record a video every day, record one. If that means, you know, you, you might want to be an editor or something. Or you might want to be a director. I don't know. You might want to be an author. You feel me? You might want to be a cook. But I'm just telling you, like, whatever you want to do, start vlogging on YouTube. Gotta help. Gotta help you for sure. I feel like YouTube, YouTube can put you in front of trillions of people, and I feel like that just just all based off watching people like Mr. Beast. You know what I'm saying? I like Mr. Beast. He he put he put a lot of time and effort into his videos, and you can tell. You know, and it'd be crazy because I look at his videos, maybe 400 and some million views. Like man, I wish. That's why. That's another reason why, like I said, I can't wait to just get my 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 thing on in track, you know, um, on track, so that way I can hire me a videographer and an editor, you know, and I can kind of tell them what I want to do. They can kind of tell me what they want to do, you know, and we can just bounce ideas and really grow the channel. You know what I'm saying? 
So, uh, like I said, right now, this is just the beginning stages. Y'all gonna get all type of videos. But one thing I'm telling y'all for sure, one thing for sure, one thing for certain, your boy is gonna be well. You know what I'm saying? You're gonna start to see your boy on more platforms. You know, you're gonna, you're gonna start to see me really just elevate my life, elevate my situation, you know, put some real motion behind what I or, or what I'm trying to do. You know what I'm saying? But uh I ain't trying to talk to y'all too much longer. I didn't pretty much made it whole. Like I said, I paid all my bills, did everything I needed to do. So now, now I can just do whatever I want to do. And if I want to do nothing, it's cool. I took care of what I needed to take care of. You feel me? Always get up. And even, even on your lazy days, take care of your business. Take care of your family. Take care of your girl. Take care of your man. Whatever you got. You know what I'm saying? But uh, it's cool, man. Make sure y'all like, share, and subscribe, and I'm out.